Likeable Advertising was formed in 2014 as a display advertising company. Fast forward six years to 2020, we've now rebranded to Single Origin Media. A lot of people think we brew coffee, we don't. There's actually a deeper meaning behind our name. Single Origin Media has an ethos or has a vision that really strives for us to become a part of an internal marketing team for our clients. So we want that positive impact to be felt across the board, whether it's a single campaign on search, social, or even a full website rebrand or even a video production. We actually want to be a part of the team, an extension of our team. So for us, as I mentioned in the past, it's not necessarily about the number of clients we work with, it's the quality and the depth of those relationships with those clients. So as full scope as we can become, that's really what single origin means, right? We, we actually want everything to originate from the same place with our clients. Single Origin's been fortunate enough to experience success over the past five years um, annually, year over year growth at about 15 to 20%. That's allowed us the opportunity to also select the best clients to work with that really fit our mold in terms of a values perspective. It's been extremely hard for me as a CEO and founder to say no to a lot of clients in the past. And I think part of the realization that I've come to is the fact that you can't help everyone. And I think analyzing and determining which people see the most value in how we operate and the people that we are and the service we provide and the performance we can drive, I think that's the most important part of how to scale and scale with grace. Our team understands that success and failure is part of any campaign. It's only a matter of when that's going to happen on both fronts. But if we have partners, vendors, clients that can align with us from a values perspective, we know that we're gonna have that client for years to come. And for our team, that's the most important aspect of this. Our vision for a client experience is extremely simplistic. We just want things to be extremely direct and extremely honest. That's, that's what we value most. When we talk about values alignment, I think the things that you know myself, my co-founder, and our team really values most is honesty and transparency. Without those two foundational aspects of any re working relationship, we know that it's gonna fail, it's just a matter of time. We want them to know this is the breakdown between management, between ad spend, between performance, because at the end of the day, it's a performance-driven business. So everything is a return on ad spend, a return on investment. So for us, transparency is making sure that the client not only understands um, the management time, but also the things that go on behind the scenes that they don't always know. So yes, we'll be on weekly calls, status calls, but things like a reporting dashboard, right? We build that as part of our, as part of our offering. Not a lot of agencies do that un unless they want to charge $10,000 for that dashboard. As part of our service, we'll go over it. You have a question, call me. You have a question, call your account manager, your account director. You know, so that's what transparency and honesty means to me. It's, it's really about the cost, the communication, and I guess just clearly defining both. One word to describe single origin would be unorthodox. I think that everything we've done since 2014 has not been by the book. So uh, in, in terms of the way we've created our company, in terms of the way we financed our company, in terms of the clients we work with. So uh, it's not the traditional startup story. We don't have the same goals. Um, we don't service the clients typically the way most agencies do at the budgets we offer. And I think that we also don't hire the typical people that would go to larger agencies or other smaller agencies. We hire based off talent and values. So I think that unorthodox approach from a business perspective to a client perspective to an internal perspective is extremely real.